on earth, there's a resource to help businesses grow revenue, boost profits, and cut turnaround in half. And would you look at that? We've got eight billion of them. Businesses that invest and believe in people get back big returns. What kind of returns? Well, there's a story there. Together, humans are responsible for creating some of the best things ever. Rock music, rocket ships, rocky road ice cream, and one idea that literally runs on human connection. The company. You know companies, you're part of one. And right there with you are other employees, customers, investors, networks, all the people that make a business like yours possible. They're the ones buying your product, getting the word out, operating the day to day. It makes perfect sense that a company would want to return the favor, and they're finding out that investing in people is good for business. Really good. Look at how some companies go all in on their employees. In the U.S., about half of employers offer training to lead their staff into new roles. And no wonder, 94% of employees will stay longer at a company that bets on their futures. Expanding skill sets yield higher productivity, engagement, and morale. Plus, it pays to hit the books or the learning portal. After investing in upskilling programs, companies can wind up with a 24% higher profit margin. So diverse skills are a no-brainer. What about a more diverse staff? Simply put, a diverse workforce is an innovative workforce. It brings the perspectives of different ethnicities, ages, genders, and orientations. But diverse hiring also pulls in countless educations, career paths, world travels, and a lot more. Basically, the stuff innovation is made of. Companies with more diversity make 19% more revenue from innovation. The diverse management team and the ideas that come with it earn 10% higher profits overall. To top it all off, retention's always higher at companies with diverse hiring policies and pay equity. Employers who offer equal pay for equal work not only keep great workers around, they attract more new talent. And with well over half of organizations planning to analyze their pay equity, those who don't will be missing out. Employees aren't the only people who keep a business in business. Let's talk customers. Most consumers say trust is especially important in times of change, as in trusting the brands they buy from, and the criteria to earn it is changing. Almost 90% of customers say they don't just want to see companies live out their values, they expect it. They expect a commitment to ethical products. They expect more inclusivity. They expect accessibility. All examples of values that actually lead to a better customer experience, better business, and a better community. After all, companies are built on communities. A small business has its neighborhood. An international brand, its global fan base. The people who share a home with the business are just as integral to its success as employees and customers. Many companies use their power and people to repay their community, funding education services, matching employee donations, giving products and services to a worthy cause. Over half of companies now offer employees paid time off to volunteer. Those that do have half the turnover. So these acts of giving feel good and have an impact on the bottom line. Companies need people to run them, to support them, to house them. And what do people get back? Products, services, a livelihood. But when businesses go beyond to add value to the planet all people share, real change happens. Real good change. That's the whole reason why we started Team Earth. The ever-growing band of businesses putting their power toward a greater good. Building a world where people, planet, and profit all thrive. You may be on Team Earth and not even know it. All it takes is action to help people or planet, and voila, you're in. Ready to make it official? Get involved at TeamEarthNow.com and show the world what a company can really do.